Well, tonight, more than 120 communities across Massachusetts are now in the COVID-19 hot zone, listed as high-risk transmission areas. Among the new spots now in red, Westwood. Here's WBZ's Bill Shields. Westwood is one of the towns just added to the red list, high-risk category for COVID, despite residents here saying they're doing everything they can. I'm doing everything. I'm wearing my mask. We, everyone stays six feet apart um, when we're working the town hall and everything. So um, I'm doing everything, and I think everyone else is. We're not going out to eat as much. Well over 100 towns are now in the red, most in the heavily populated areas in Eastern Mass. New state data indicates the growth is now coming from small clusters and contact with immediate family members. It's probably not something that we can stem with economic rollbacks, reopening rollbacks. Um, it's not something that can be stemmed with closing schools. Uh, it's something that really has to be taken on by uh, the individuals. And if it's getting frustrating and COVID fatigue is setting in, people in Westwood told me today they'll keep up the fight. We've been in this situation for so long. People are missing their loved ones, their friends. People are craving a sense of normalcy. Do you think, you think you're not doing what you need to do? No, I mean, no. I, I think, think we're, we're doing everything we're supposed to do. Yeah. I spoke with the health agents today of two different towns, both of those towns also in the red, and asked simply, what do you think? And one said, here's what I think. I think we have Halloween this weekend, parties. I think we have Thanksgiving in three weeks, family gatherings. It's only going to get worse. In Westwood, I'm Bill Shields, WBZ News.